Good morning, it's Ada Sparks here with a word of hope. I want to show you a couple of signs I have in my house. The people who moved into my previous house got a little amused because they said they found little notes everywhere that I had left to my family. I thought I had moved all of those notes and I didn't realize I left so many until they pointed it out. So here's one right here underneath my microwave. It says, cover your food or clean the microwave. Now I'm gonna show you the inside of my microwave. I realize most people wouldn't do that, but I'm pretty transparent. You can see they don't always read the note. Now here you can see this note. This one's kind of rude. Somebody ripped it apparently. It says, please wash your filthy hands before getting ice. That's because our ice maker doesn't always work, so you have to reach in and grab the ice yourself. Now, as you can see, I'm a little obsessive about people just being clean. I like to have a clean house. I just want things clean, all right? When you walk on the door, I have hand sanitizer right beside the door. I have two different ways that you can wash your hand by the sink, plus hand sanitizer. There's nothing wrong with being clean, especially in the pandemic that we're in right now, right? And I just wanna point out that even the scripture talks about it. You know, I'm gonna bring a verse in here to bring up my point. In Psalms 24 and four, it says, he that has clean hands and a pure heart. And verse five says, he shall receive the blessing from the Lord. So I just want to wrap up today and say, wash your hands because Jesus and germs are everywhere. Be wise, not afraid.